Over a decade after the Fukushima nuclear disaster, Japan's nuclear regulator has granted an initial approval to release wastewater from the REC nuclear plant into the sea next year. Japan's nuclear regulator claims that the plan is made conservatively, so the radiation impact on the environment could be still below the legal limit in case of any thinkable risks. え、記事務局長はウクライナの原子力施設の安全セキュリティを確保するため、自らチョルノビーリ原発に足を運ばれたと承知しており、これまでの強いリーダーシップに敬意を表します。Tokyo Electric Power, a Japanese electric company, will carry out the release plan. However, the final approval will be given after a one-month public comment period. The decision has come on the day when International Atomic Energy Agency Chief Rafael Grossi met with Japan's Trade Minister Koichi Hagoida. Now, the IAEA is tasked with conducting safety reviews of the planned release. The Japanese government approved the discharge of over 1 million tons of treated radioactive waste water from the site in 2021. The announcement provoked concerns from local communities and the neighbors China. And uh, Korea and uh, Grossi has now said that the IAEA's reviews would give the world confidence that the water in question will have no negative impact on public health. You refer to the work that uh, we are conducting in Fukushima, where I will go myself uh, tomorrow, and we will be having some detailed discussions about this, but let me here now uh, say uh, how um, grateful we are for the positive collaboration we are having. Uh, we decided uh, some time ago that we would be working together in this, and we are doing just that. The Japanese firm to carry out release will build a tunnel reaching into the sea for the operation. It will filter the water by removing 60 isotopes, leaving only tritium and the radioactive isotope of hydrogen. The Japanese regulator sanctioned the plan after looking into factors such as performance of the diluting equipment, ways to stop the release in case of abnormalities and countermeasures against tsunamis and earthquakes. Even after the approval, firm conducting the release needs the consent of the local communities, including the governor and mayors. The new facilities are scheduled to be completed by mid-April of next year, starting the discharge around spring of 2023. We are now available in your country. Download the app now. Get all the news on the move.